Some upstate veterans got the chance to uh, take a flight back in time today on a biplane, the same kind used to train the military in the 1940s. The nonprofit that made it all possible says their mission is to give back to those who have given. On a blue sky dream day for flying, upstate veterans took off on a dream of their own. I've always wanted a ride in a biplane. The Ageless Aviation Dreams Foundation flies all over the country, taking veterans up in a restored 1940s biplane. They have a lot of tears on their cheeks, and so do we. It's, it's incredible. There you go. Air Force veteran John Madison didn't let a recent knee replacement stop him from getting on board. I'm just tickled to death to go. Hey, there you go. 86 years old, what do you expect? I'm lucky to be alive. Okay, and this makes me alive. Flying makes me alive. Carl Stoner served in the Army and the Navy. For him, the trip brings back a flood of memories. Reminds me of all my old friends that didn't make it. A lot of friends didn't make it. And I lost a lot of friends during Korea and so forth. And this is a memory of them. Thank you for all your years of service. Because that's why we do this. The nonprofit will repeat this journey hundreds more times across the U.S., giving free rides to thank the men and women for their service. They're turning around thanking us, and no, we're trying to thank them. <laughs> you know, so just thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> thank you for all your service. For the veterans, the flight is only outdone by the feeling of being honored and appreciated. It is a memory that I will cherish for a long time. Oh, well, it's a great effort. Did there. you get to go on the plane? I didn't, but I didn't want to take away a trip from uh, them. That's true. That's, that's a good point. <laughs> well, stay with us. Uh, Seven on your side at six starts right now.